Yo, welcome back to the house where we talk news, celebrities, and hot topics. You guys, what the hell is going on in the world of news? Now, the writings were on the wall, were they not? And we were just talking about CNN yesterday, right? We were just talking about those fools and how the new CEO is coming down and he wants a piece of that Fox News share. He wants some of that conservative viewership. And so he's coming in and he's changing things up and he's getting rid of hosts. Remember I said yesterday he's getting rid of hosts. He's changing up the program. Now we have Charles Barkley and Gail King hosting a, uh, a show called King Charles. OK, remember I said that. Remember three weeks ago, Variety exposed uh, Don Lemon for his misogynistic ways over the uh, last 15 years. Remember about a month before that he was, uh, you know, pummeled. He was pummeled. And the, uh, you know, media for uh, basically saying that Nikki Haley, presidential candidate on the Republican side, is really not, uh, you know, in her prime. Mm. OK. And then before that, we uh, got wind that CNN wasn't really happy with Mr. Don Lemon and what he was bringing to the table because he had his own prime time show with Don Lemon tonight. They canceled it. They demoted him from prime time to morning time. And not only that, he had to share the platform with Caitlin Collins. I told you guys for like three months at this point that Don Lemon is going to be fired. It seems like they are phasing him out. And what happened today? They got rid of his ass. Don Lemon, CNN has parted ways with longtime host Don Lemon. The announcement Monday came without explanation and astonished the media industry. All right, CNN says, that Don will forever be a part of the CNN family, and we thank him for his contributions over the past 17 years. We wish him well, and we'll be cheering him on with his future endeavors. It is a sad, 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 sad day, okay? And then on top of all of that, you guys, Gail King is coming into CNN once a week, Wednesday nights. She's getting paid millions to show up on air for one hour a week. And so I know with the dwindling ratings, OK, how Candace Diller Bassett said the dwindling uterus, CNN has dwindling ratings. OK, so they're in shambles right now and they don't have a lot of cash at this particular point in time. And so they just hired Gail King, which was also to me another indication that somebody else is getting fired. Because once you give somebody a 20 million dollar check, that means someone else's salary has gone down the drain. Now, for me personally, I just want to be petty towards you guys, okay? Towards the house guests. And I want to say, I told you so. I told you so. I told you. I told you. Thank you. You heard it here first. Um, but I am quite disappointed in the situation. I'm not going to lie. I love Don Lemon. Despite his problematic ways, I love him. I root for everybody black, especially everybody gay and black, right? And so I feel like Don Lemon is a trailblazer. He did not do everything perfectly. He made mistakes, but he's a, 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 a good journalist. And I felt like he was a really good host or a really good anchor on to the CNN. All right. So I'm actually very, 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 very sad. But y'all, not only is CNN parting ways with Mr. Don Lemon, but Fox News just fired Tucker Carlson. OK, it is a whole hot damn mess. This is a big day in the world of cable news, because I would say over there at CNN, Don Lemon and Anderson Cooper are probably the biggest names. And then at Fox News, the three biggest names would be Tucker Carlson, Sean Hannity and Laura Ingram. Tucker being the biggest. Tucker brings in most of the advertising dollars. Most folks tune in to Tucker Carlson when they're watching Fox News. And they just let him go. OK, according to The Washington Post and a surprise announcement, Fox News announced Monday that its controversial yet top rated primetime host Tucker Carlson is leaving the network. They said Fox News Media and Tucker Carlson have agreed to part ways. The network said in a statement, we thank him for his service to the network as a host and prior to that as a contributor. Mm, this is crazy why did he get fired because he's a liability now maybe it was a part of the settlement for him to be fired for you know uh them not putting in the settlement that fox news had to make a public apology on air maybe instead they opted for that man being fired i mean who knows but i i would assume that it has something to do with the 787 million dollar settlement 
I would assume because Tucker Carlson is a liability. Right? I would assume it's because brother man is a liar, liar, pants on fire. His pants are always on fire. I mean, lying every night. Do you get tired spewing out the same lies every other night? All right. So it's a lot of drama. I don't know if Tucker Carlson has made a statement. Let me do some Googling. Has he made a statement? Tucker leaves Fox News. I don't think Tucker has made a statement. Only Fox News has made a statement. OK, um, I think Don Lemon made a statement uh, onto the Twitter. This is really interesting. I think there's some infighting going on between Tucker or excuse me, Don Lemon and CNN. Um, let me see. Don Lemon wrote, I am stunned. Right. And then he went on to say that management did not have the decency child to inform him of his firing directly. OK, he said, at no time was I ever given any indication that I would not be able to continue to do the work that I have loved at the network. OK, so Don Lemon states that this was abrupt and he didn't really see it coming. And I would assume that Mr. Tucker Carlson probably feels the same way. But what's interesting and uh, dramatic is the fact that CNN rebutted and uh, they called his version of events inaccurate. They wrote he was offered Don Lemon was offered an opportunity to meet with management, but instead released a statement on Twitter. And I, oh, OK, CNN said we're clearing our name. <laughs> CNN said, Donnie, you're not going to lie on our name. Now, I believe that CNN went to Don Lemon's agent first. And then the agent went to Don Lemon and said, hey, you're about to be fired. Management wants to speak to you. And then Don Lemon went to Twitter. So I think both parties are telling the truth, but also hiding some truths. Y'all got to let me know how y'all feel about this uh, messy situation in the comments down below. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to create a great day.